The big breaking news coming in from the Supreme Court. The government has informed the Supreme Court that women will be admitted into the National Defense Academy for permanent commission into India's armed forces. The center informing the top court that women uh, will be allowed to compete for NDA courses, calling it a historic decision. The government, however, asking for some more time to lay down guidelines and timelines, it seems. Sukiti joining us at this point with more on that big story. Sukiti, what are we hearing? Uh, well, Ankita, as you mentioned, absolutely historic and uh, those are also the terms that the government used itself while informing the Supreme Court. Uh, so uh, just uh, a very short background of where all of this is happening from. On August 18, the Supreme Court had already passed interim directions that women should be allowed to give the NDA examinations and had asked the government uh, that we hope that you will take uh, more decisions in this regard yourself rather than waiting for us to step into this entire matter and then intervene. So today, uh, additional solicitor general General Ishwarya Bharti informed the government that uh, we are delighted to inform you that the government is uh, going to induct women into uh, for the NDA as well as naval examinations. However, the NDA examinations have already been uh, postponed from June to November. So uh, we need some more time to frame the guidelines. So time is all we are asking for. Uh, we are already saying that we are delighted to inform you. This is going to be a path breaking and a historic decision. It's going to change things. Uh, that's when the court responded by saying that uh, we are glad that you have taken steps in this regard uh, by your own uh, decision uh, and rather than waiting for the judiciary to intervene we would always want a more proactive approach uh, from the armed forces in this regard because it is a respectable force it, it it plays a very important role but it needs to do more in terms of gender equality so we are happy that you are informing us yourself that you've taken this decision to induct women into india as well as naval examinations but uh, there are going to be a few more days before the government uh, submits its guidelines, its timelines with regard to how the entire logistics of all of this is going to work out. Uh, that affidavit will be filed by the government by 20th of September and this matter will come up again in the Supreme Court on 22nd September.